Hello everyone and welcome to another tutorial. Today I want to show you how you can upgrade the previous setup so it can bone meal the plants just by adding some bones in this chest. Like this. As you might have noticed I'm using here different box, it's called Advanced Cable Cluster. It's made by crafting together Advanced Cable Cluster, Block Detector and Block Gate. And I'm using it just because it makes this setup a little more compact. But in this tutorial we will be using the previous design. So let's get started. So I adjusted the previous setup a little bit. I made one gap between them. Because sometimes the seeds can flow around and like this you can place block in between. And this can prevent that from happening. Then you wanna place some block gates two blocks from the ground above each of the plants like this it can simulate the right click so that they can bone meal the plants and then you want to connect all of this together by some cables and then we can get to the programming as you might notice I already set up some things here so let's see what I did. First you wanna set up three new variables. One of them is called Miller's const. It's local variable, container types just inventory, and you wanna select all of the block gates which are on the top. The Y coordinate can help you find them easily. And then mealers, this is global variable, container types just inventory, containers you want to select mealers const. Maybe not the best color I could use but believe me it's there. And then finally mealer, you want to select just global variable, inventory and that's all you want to set up here. Then we want to have option to reset the mealers variable so we create new standard variable it's gonna set the mealers to mealers const like this connect these guys together then we create another standard variable this will set the mealer to the first one of mealers like this like this then another standard variable it's gonna remove from mealers the mealer Then uh, we want to connect these guys together. Then create new input from from the wolf. We want to set up the wolf right here. Remember the wolf has radius of three blocks. So if your farm is bigger, you want to place more of these wolves and then select all of them in here target and aside items whitelist just bone meal then we can connect these guys create new output inventories the chest target down and aside you can select and blacklist. Then we want a new input from the chest and a side and whitelist only bone meal and bone. Then we can connect these guys. Then create new crafter. It will craft the bone meal for us so select just 
the bone in here it will automatically detect what we want to craft then uh, select the strong box in excess inventories and that's all you want to do here then create new output inventories you want to select Miller any site and whitelist one bone meal like this and then you wanna connect all these guys together and that should be all you need to do in here so now let's try it place some bones in this chest and as you can see it's working perfectly so there you have it I hope you enjoyed this tutorial see you next time I placed one gap between them I made one gap between them I made one gap between them so that they can bone meal the plants <laughs>